is general reading. This may or may not resonate, okay? If it doesn't, check out the other placements. If you need a person's reading, all that information is going to be below. Uh, your current situation with the Three of Cups here, okay? So it looks like there is a potential of a reconciliation right now, okay? If this is not a reunion, it does look like um, you're chilling, you're having fun, you know, you're okay. One of you is, okay? One of you is just partying, uh, focusing on their happiness and just doing what makes them happy, okay? That's the overall situation here, Three of Cups. On your mind is the death here. So you could have ended things with this person out here, okay? Whilst this person on their mind, they're emotionally absolutely shut off, okay? They're not wanting to be emotionally vulnerable towards you. Um, for the charity in reverse here, you probably wanted things to move forward, okay? Like, But they were just not moving forward as quickly as you wanted it to, okay? You could be um, rushing things, all right? But yeah, things are just not moving at your speed. On their, on their emotions is the two of swords here. So this person needs to make a decision, but they're absolutely indecisive right now, okay? They're choosing not to make a decision. And uh, also someone who's blocking any kind of clarity, okay? This is someone who's blocking their heart chakra and someone who's just not ready to open up towards you. Even if you try to talk to this person here, you're just going to be very, very disappointed. So disappointed, so don't even try. The mutual energy between both of you is the two of pentacles. You both try to make up your mind about what you want to do. This person more. Okay, this person more. You probably are quite decisive because you've ended things, okay, with the death here because it was just not moving forward. You wanted quick movement here. With the Ten of Wands here as your action, this is a situation which is too much of a burden for you, okay? It's too much of a this relationship, this connection. It's not becoming a burden to you, okay? So you're ready to release this situation and lay it off. This person out here with a hierophant in reverse here looks like this is definitely someone who is commitment for, okay? This is someone who doesn't like to do things the traditional way. And that could be one of the reasons here why you are ended things with this person, okay? High priestess in reverse as the outcome. So either this is someone who's giving the silent treatment, they're going to be ready to talk. Or this is someone who is just not being able to trust their intuition and their trust. They're having a hard time differentiating between their ego and their intuition, okay? Let's see. Wow. What's so, happening? Why the death? Why is the three of cups here? <coughs> Four of swords in reverse. The tower and the five of swords in reverse here. Definitely someone who's coming in unexpectedly wanting a reconciliation, okay? This is definitely someone you walked away from. Someone who is playing, who is just fucking with you, okay? Or someone who is just playing a lot of mind games. This is someone who's finally ready to talk to you, okay? Coming out of isolation and trying to talk to you. But with the tower here, it's going to be very unexpected, okay? So yeah, there is a potential of a reconciliation here with the three of cups here. And this is coming in. If this hasn't, it will. Definitely someone you've ended things with, okay? Someone who, walked, who you walked away from in the past because you felt very defeated. Someone who was constantly pushing you away, you know, due to fear because their guards were up. And they constantly have a habit of sabotaging the connection between you both, okay? So, yeah, someone's ready to um, come out and talk, come out of their shell. This person could have healed or this person could have just withdrawn from you. But they're coming in and you won't be expecting this. What's the depth? What's the depth? Why is this? Here. Yeah. <coughs> Queen of Swords in reverse, Eight of Pentacles in reverse, and the chair. Okay. You stop putting in the work, okay? Because you were seeing no results. You put in your 100%, but there were just no results. You could have given this person an ultimatum over and over and over and over again, but this person was just someone who refused to listen to you, or it was just hitting a wall, you know? You couldn't get through your point, you know, to this person. And finally, you were fed up of them and you cut them off. You cut them off from a place, a place of a lot of resentment, you know? Very unforgiving, very bitter towards this person, okay? Because of course, I understand because you put in so much work, right? And with the chariot here, you're moving forward. And you're hell-bent on moving forward. Hell-bent on moving forward. You've cut them out in a way where, you know, you're like, screw you. I'm moving forward. I don't want to be with you, you know? 
because you are very disappointed because you just didn't see the results of the kind of effort that you put in, you know. And you just cut this person off. Definitely being very cold and very unloving towards this person, you know. I understand. <clears throat> Why is the Ace of Cups in reverse on this person's mind? The Emperor is the Three of Cups in reverse and the High Priest is in reverse. Could be a third party situation, okay? Maybe there was a third person here and now they're dropping that third person here, okay? Again, High Priest is in reverse here. This is someone who's ready to talk. This could, could be a third person here involved, okay, between you both. But I feel they're dropping the third party here because with the Empress here, they see you, they see your value, they see your self worth, they see you as marriage material, they want commitment with you. Yeah, they see you as someone very abundant, they see you as someone who doesn't give a shit to them, you know, you're okay on your own. <coughs> I see something is wrong with you. Uh, you could be dealing with someone, you know, who, again, is someone who is not being able to trust their intuition. Also, is what I'm getting here. But I think more like this is someone who's ready to talk. Okay, on their mind, they definitely want to have a conversation. They may be emotionally shut off, okay? Because they're sad, they're upset, they're depressed that you've gone away. They see that there are chances you won't want this reconciliation with them, okay? But yeah. Um why is the two of pentacles here? <clears throat> the six of cups, the six of swords and the hermit. Definitely a lot of withdrawn energy, okay? One of you has pulled back, both of you have pulled back, okay? You're both doing a lot of soul searching, a lot of inner thinking. You know, you've gone within to find the answers, both of you. You're trying to take your own time, taking your space, not talking, no communication. But if you're with the Six of Cups and Six of Swords, you both feel the strong soulmate connection and you both want to get out of this rocky waters and move towards a calmer place. But with the Hermit here, you're both contemplating on what you want to do next, okay? Um... Tell me about the two of swords. Tell me about the two of swords. Whoa. So, yeah. Two of swords here. They have a lot of love for you. Page of cups. They want to communicate with you. Page of swords. They're watching you from a distance. But when it comes to talking and opening their mouth, they're suppressing the truth. There, there's a lot of resistance of communication from this person. They won't let the truth out because the truth is that they love you, they want you, they want a reconciliation with you, they want to apologize to you, okay? But they'll watch, look at you from a distance, spying, stalking, but everything at a distance. When it comes to talking to you and coming and clarifying the situation, they won't do it. They just won't do it. They'll hold back communication as much as they can. They are determined to hold back the communication, okay? Because I think they're doing a lot of thinking with the two of swords here. I feel for right now, they're trying to ignore the situation, okay, as much as they can. <clears throat> Tell me about uh, the Hierophant in divorce. Why is the Hierophant in divorce? Wow, this person fears commitment big time, okay? They realize there's a fucking strong soulmate connection, okay? Twin flame soulmate connection. Be of fortune, justice, and the lovers in reverse here. So this person definitely has a lot of love for you, okay? They do love you very, very much. They feel the strong soul tie connection to you, okay? They want to bring balance to the situation. Be of fortune, they're wanting forward movement with you, okay? They want positive change. But they want a positive change. They want growth with you. But when it comes to labeling the connection, that's when they're not going to do it. Because this is someone who could be someone, you know, who's emotionally not available or someone who's emotionally not wanting to invest into this connection, you know. So I feel you are more emotionally involved in this connection than them, okay. And they are making a decision more like, um, a decision more in fear, you know. They're making a more a decision due to fear, you know. They're not making the right choice. They know what they need to do, but they're choosing not to only because of fear of commitment, you know, they're not on the same page with you, but they want to bring justice to this relationship here. They're waiting for the right time, probably. But when it comes to committing, that's when they're not going to do it. 
Okay, so yeah, the love is there, but when it comes to labeling the connection, it doesn't look like they will. Um, tell me why is the high priestess in reverse? Why is this the outcome? Why is the high priestess in reverse here? Why is this the outcome? Five of Pentacles in reverse, Ace of Wands in reverse. Oh la la, Ten of Cups. Wow, this person's finally gonna talk to you, like I said. This person's feeling very isolated, they're feeling very left out by you in the cold, okay? They have this lack mentality, they're trying to come out of it, okay? Could be someone who has a lot of abandonment issues. That's why the Hierophant is reversed, okay? This person could be someone who's gone through a bad relationship in the past year. They could have been very committed, but someone screwed them over, okay? So this person definitely wants to return back to you. They want to talk to you, okay? Something's going to be revealed for the High Priestess in reverse here. They want the Ten of Cups here, all right? They want this happily ever after with you. But the problem here is with the Ace of Wands in reverse here, they're lacking the action. So I do feel that it's going to be communication between you guys, okay? But it's probably there are chances that it's going to be a false start, Okay? Because again, this is not the kind of approach you're looking for, okay? They're coming back to you. Yes, they are. But <clears throat> it's it's the same cycle here, okay? It's like, it's a once and reverse is a situation which is going nowhere, right? But this is again lack of action. Like the passion is there, but they're not taking action towards it. So I feel when they're going to come back to you, you're going to be the one who is not going to give any pain and heat to them, okay? That's why this could be a missed opportunity in a new beginning. Because they definitely have this reunion on their mind. That's the current situation. So they are coming towards you, okay? But with a likely outcome here. <clears throat> again, when it comes to that new beginning here, I feel it's going to be a false start. Again, because they're not coming to you in the right approach, okay? Again, they're coming into you towards you with that non-committal attitude. But yes. They love you a lot and they want this happily ever after with you. But when it comes to putting in that label or getting exclusive or getting married, etc., that's what they're running from, okay? They're commitment phobic. So that's something you need to take care of, okay? That's what I have for you, Cancer. I hope this reading resonates with you. Leave your comments below, like, share, subscribe, and I will see you next time.